Hello folks and welcome to my next blog entry. Now this one's a bit of an unusual blog entry uh, to my normal ones. Um, apart from the fact that I'm here in sunny Weymouth and, uh, and, and, that, and that I'm on a holiday uh, which I get once every year. Now um, I'm on here today to do a bit of a rant really and when I say a rant I mean I am really seriously pissed off with some eBay. Uh, so much so it's made me swear. Now I won, I won a uh, server rack, a 42U server rack from eBay for 26 quid yesterday, which I made a video about, which you'll be able to see um, in my list uh, on, the, on either the left or the right, depending on which way this video goes. Um, have, have, a, have a watch of that one and then carry on watching this video. Um, I'll also put a link at the top of the screen for that particular video. Now the reason I am really, really pissed off with this eBay is um, when I emailed him to ask him, about, I mean, forty pound was quite was quite cheap for a server actually posted. I would have expected fifty to sixty pound reason, or possibly even more. Um, I've had people quote me eighty pounds in the past uh, for deli to deliver a forty-two U rack because of its weight and size. Um, so I, I emailed the seller and I said, uh, I, I won't disclose the seller's uh, username, although I, I really would like to. Um, he had negative feedback from me. What, what this seller did is I emailed him to ask him what method he was going to use, because I've never seen it so cheap before for £40 of postage. Um, he came back and said, leave it with me, um, I'll go and uh, chat with my colleagues. Uh, and then I'll come back to you with a price and what company, uh, not with a price, which company we're going to use. So I said, okay, great. Um, I look forward to hearing from you soon. Anyway, because a long story short, he didn't email me back. So I emailed him again uh, and he came back with a response uh, with, um, sorry mate, but our forklift truck has now dropped the, uh, dropped the rack um, and is now all, all but scrap. And I said, well, that's a bit stupid. Uh, but instead of saying, hey Dean, listen, we can't deliver it for 40 quid, um, he decided to say that it was now scrap. Now to that eBay who sold me that rack, shame on you. Um, it really pissed me off, and I've had to go now spend more money to get a rack that I originally got for 26 quid. So now, folks, I've ended up spending 140 quid. Uh, from, a, from a more reputable company, one that I've had its successful dealings with in the past. Um, so to that eBayer, shame on you. Um, and really it's a shame that I can't identify you on this video because unfortunately it has my name all over the eBay ID. So um, for that reason I'll, I'll choose not to name a shame in this video. But for those other eBayers out there who decide to list something on eBay, if you're going to list something on eBay, list it for the price you're expecting to get for it. Uh, and not for that of, um, oh, I'll list it for 99p, get all this interest, and then, uh, and then if it doesn't sell for what you want it, then make it some kind of lame excuse. Um, some kind of lame excuse to, to not sell it to you. Um, anyway, rant's over. If you like my videos, or any other of my videos, please rate, comment, and subscribe below. And my name is Dean, I'm Super Server Dude. And I'll see you in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.